Welcome back everybody. Okay, so in between, I think, what are we today? Day 27. So um, I took a day to go get, this. we ran out of material, so I took a day to go get some more materials. Just went back to the same small island. It's getting less and less on there, but there's still stuff there to, to be had, so... We'll still pop back there for some more stuff if need be, but I'm hoping I've now got enough material to finish off the roof on our house and uh, get some little walls up around here. I've uh, moved the cooker to where the camp was and moved or the shelter, moved the shelter to over here. I'll get rid of this. Um, if you stack the palm fronds uh, by dropping them um, out of your inventory, you can stack them three high and I'll uh, make a nice little tree. For those that have stripped their islands of all other greenery, that's uh, at least maybe one way of getting it back. Uh, so just to open this up a bit, um, it's taken a bit of arson about to get everything to fit, but I think I'm pretty happy with that now. So we should have some sticks here. Right, roof to go up, little side walls to go up as well. So what have I got left now? These are the crates I went over to get. I've already taken out from there. Okay, I don't know what I'm carrying. Oh, sticks still, okay. So it's sticks I need. So let's get some more, chop these down. So I think I'm just going to use the, the thatch type roofing on this. I don't really have the materials for anything else. But I think they look nice. We'll see what else we need doing. And then once we've got this up and running, I might spend a little bit of time tarting it up. Uh, because I think once we've got this done, um, I want to get back out to some of the islands, either that big one out there. These are the islands that are immediately around us. Or that small one there. I still need to expand uh, the raft. I know, it's an expression I'm even getting bored of uh, listening to now, but it needs to be done. Right, building. Let's go over to roofs. Roof middle. It should be this one. Twist that round. Okay, looks good. What about here? Same again. And then these we want the corner. Is that the corner? That's the wedge, isn't it? So I definitely want the corner. Oh, there we go. Straight away. Nice. Let's do that again. It's coming together. Oh, out of sticks already. Uh, did I leave some down there? I pulled, picked them all up, didn't I? Hopefully that may be enough. I've got some more logs if need be. Come on. Nice. It's just a... It's not a very fancy living accommodation, but it's a nice accommodation. Okay, so let's get this built up. Let's go and have a look. At least we'll have somewhere to keep the midday sun off us, because I think once you're inside it doesn't really... the UV doesn't count. Yeah. Small little shack, this will look fine. All I need in here is basically a camp bed, some storage for some chests. Might try and stick a table in there just so I can put some bits and pieces on it, or I may stick that in the middle of our little encampment area. Those will be the little bits I'll add to as I sort of find bits of time here and there. And there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> uh, our two by three. It's fine. I like it. Now, let's get some walls up. I put a little corner piece on so I could angle this in. I might stick another one on. I'm just trying to think, you know, what feels like a an entrance way. Uh, how much wood have I got on me? I need to... right, let's chop up some more. 
trying different things out, trying where I can put platforms or foundations down. Expand. Well, let's get these half walls up, see how it's looking. Oh, that's that hammer done. I do have another. So I'm only doing them part build just so I get this open lattice effect. Go on, right there. And I might put a roof on some of this, I'm not sure. I'll have a little play around. There'll, there'll be a point you'll come back and I'll go, ah, look, I've embellished. How exactly? I'm not sure. I just wanted to get this done. Make sure you guys were, and girls, were all there. Uh, uh, participating and watching. So this makes the whole area here just feel a lot more open. I like this. It's a pity I can't put anything actually on this. I might try and... I don't know if you can glitch the, the furnace on there. I doubt it, but we'll, we'll see. So what was I looking at if I've got any more... Oh, no, that's what I wanted. Yeah. It was allowing me to put, yeah, sort of sink this into the sand a bit. If I can do that, I'll have an edge or a wall that I can put. Can I do it with a whole foundation? Stop doing that. I can do it with a whole foundation and sink that in, then I can actually put a wall up. What's that blue there? Surely that just glitches into it, it wouldn't allow that. I was hoping I could get it maybe a little lower. So that we could get a wall running along the back here as well. I say a wall, I mean these half walls. And do I want to put another one of these in here? I think so. Let's see if it'll allow me to put the half wall in. So have I actually got any more wood on me? Enough, yes. Oh, I think that looks pretty cool. What do you think, everybody? It'll do the job, won't it? And then, uh, shall I put the little balcony out here as well? See how many more logs we've got. I'm sure I've got a few more. Oh yeah, only a few more though. Why does it drop the hammer? Chop these up. Okay, let's see what we can do for this back veranda bit. We're going to need to open, uh, open the door. Thank you. And let's have a look. Where are we? Platforms, I guess, again. Is that the way I was... Yeah, crossways, I'll do it that way. Place that, can I reach? Yes. Okay, I'm just hitting a wood door. Wood foundation, there we go. Let's close that, let's put a couple more up. 
it. <laughs> like it. I'm going to do some fishing. I've done much in the way of fishing in the last playthrough. It's it's for when you have time. And then I can either expand it out here. You can see the sand goes out quite a bit, so I could put a little pier sticking out from here, or I could go out one more. I want to put some stairs on here, I guess. Oh, I can jump it. I like it. Let's have a look what we look like over from here. There. Very rudimentary. It does the job nicely, I think. I do like the way these half walls are going around. I just don't know. Do I want to fill them in or do I want them open? I might actually fill them in. I'm not sure. But while I'm not sure, let's just get a quick save done. No, save, not sleep. And we've got our tanning rack, we've got our cooker, we've got our water still. I will need to make a couple more. Look at where I'm going to put the plantations loom. So what was left... Get to the right menu. Is the plank station. No, not the plank station. Furnace. Brick station and fuel fuel still <laughs> boiler. Ugh, tongue twister. Fuel still boiler. Uh, furnace. Six rocks. Two. I might have a little play around to figure out where they're going to go. I'm not entirely 100% sure how I'm going to want that to look. Right, what else do I need to add? So I'm going to want some hooks to put these lanterns on, but I quite like them over here at the moment. Where have I got them? One here one here. I've got a spare one there. Let's get a little bit more wood. Have I got any on me? Enough to make a hook. So let's have a look. Not in this menu. Under the furniture. There we go. Where can I put the hook? Let's try there by the doorway, and let's grab this lantern. And hang this up here. I don't know how much it'll light up on the inside, but it should light up on the outside. This one I might be able to move around. Yeah, I don't like looking at um, the survivor skeleton anymore. If, if you use an item, this crate actually moves around. You can't move it yourself, but if you hold something in your hand, I was holding the uh, flare gun, I could smack it in the side and move it around. So I've covered him up a bit. <laughs> survivors. So we just watched a beautiful sunrise here out in the Pacific from our new abode. I need the sun to come up and show you what I've been working on. So I've been uh, playing around. <coughs> That'll do for now. That's the sun coming up. I said I wanted to put like a little wall around and I wasn't quite sure how I was going to do it. Just really just sort of to wrap this into it like a a little compound area. So I've been having a play around with where to place foundations and I think I've got it to map around okay. I'm not sure if these foundations are laid out the right way. So I thought okay if we can end up with a little wall around here and make it into a little compound. I've had to move some stuff out of the way. I'll tidy up later. 
So I thought we'd give that a go. I wanted to bring you in for that one. So I'm going to just put all this together. And let's have a look at it at the end. Fast forward that for you so that it wasn't too tedious. Smacking everything with a hammer. Hmm, what do you think? That's pretty smart. I quite like this. I can always put some storage stuff up on uh, on these bits here, couldn't I? I think I'll leave this bit open. I might try and build something here in the corner just to give it that wrap around feeling maybe over there as well um, but this is the one I was trying to get done so I was just having a little play around while I was tidying up I did chop a few of my trees down not too many though well actually more than not too many actually <laughs> with the coconuts but that should be enough uh, next uh, tree haul I'm going to do from another island but uh, yeah I don't know if I might put roofs on here um, I don't know. Oh, and that was the other thing I was mucking around with as well. I extended out the roof. It basically was just this hut at one point, and I quite like this little overhang. So I tried it out and thought, yeah, I like this. So it's a hot climate. You want the breeze, hence all the windows and a sort of an open feel to the whole thing. So uh, I think that's come together really quite well. I like the little fencing around the side as well. So that should conclude the uh, building of the base video. The rest of it will be updates, upgrades. There will be some other bits and pieces I'll get round to, sort of either off camera or with you, depending on how things play out over the forthcoming episodes. I am queen. Uh, queen. I am very keen to get out to two of the islands that are nearby that we haven't explored so that I can go check out their wrecks because I still need the raft to be upgraded but uh, as far as the camp is concerned very pleased with this love the wall around there love the way that sort of makes it all feel wrapped in get a few more lanterns as well that'll be nice to put those out and we still need to put up the uh, furnace so the furnace pretty quickly yeah the furnace and I'm hoping maybe that can go around here because it'll give out some light. So I've got some lanterns around. We've got the campfire. Um, I think at night it'll look very pretty as well. So I can't wait to see this when it's uh, lit up at night. But that's for a future episode. So anyway, that's uh, just to finish off the camp build. Hope you enjoyed uh, the episode. Well, the last couple of episodes putting this together, really. Uh, next time you join us, we will be off uh, doing some more adventuring. Alright, all the best, thanks for joining, take care, stay safe, and see you in the next episode.